I'm proud of the stand that we took on Bill C-51. When it first came out, when we first made the decision, pundits said we were crazy because public opinion was all in support. In fact, the pundits called that support a juggernaut. Instead of rushing to judgment, we took our time to analyze the bill and to consult with experts. When it was clear that C-51 was going to be a threat to our fundamental rights as Canadians, we had to do what was right. We had to stand up, make it clear why we were against it and why it was something that Canadians had to fight against. I published opinion pieces, uh, both in the paper and online, talked with experts, and I talked with people throughout the community about Bill C-51. In March, I held a town hall at the Micmac Aquatic Club uh, so that people could come together, hear from some ex experts, and talk about what was in this bill and why it was a problem. You see, former prime ministers, Supreme Court justices, uh, organizations like Lead Now and um, Amnesty International had spoken out against this, as did increasingly Canadians across the country. As time went by and people better understood how bad Bill C-51 was, opinions changed uh, and it was the Conservatives and the Liberals who were offside and people were agreeing increasingly with the NDP. When it came to the final vote, it was the NDP and the Greens who opposed it. It was the Liberals and Conservatives who voted in favor. And people know that an NDP government will repeal Bill C-51.